Hello you guys, Michelle here. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video I think is just going to be a little mini random vlog. Sorry for the shit on my lip. I know it looks like I got into a fight. But it was actually just a little cold sore that I had that is now a scab. Yeah, that's probably most of the reason why I didn't really film last week. Honestly, I was kind of going through it. This cold sore was one of like those ugly ones. And you guys know that I don't give a fuck about my cold sores. But this one was getting to me. I have been feeling a little bit under the weather. And also the weather has been back and forth here in my Miami. I don't have to explain to you why I get cold sores. If you guys have been following me for a minute, you guys know that it's a uh, it happens. It's a regular thing here. But yeah, so but this one was kind of ugly and it just I just really wasn't feeling myself. Today's video is just gonna be a random vlog. I don't know if I already said that. It's a couple days before Christmas. There's no one in the house. This is very rare. I think this is the first time since I moved back to my house that I have been alone in the house. So I decided to just to, just to start filming. Um, I think I'm going to pack uh people's Christmas gifts. So I just thought why not show you guys what I got everyone. So yeah, let me go grab the gifts. God, I look fucking hideous. Anyone who I tell that I do YouTube, because me, like, if someone were to tell me, like, hey, like, I do YouTube, like, I would, like, when I remember, I'd go and, like, see, like, what is it that they do on YouTube. Yeah, this is better. We're gonna leave my hair down because I was looking really fucking crazy. You know what I mean? Like, if someone were to tell me, hey, I do YouTube, I'm gonna go ahead and see what you do. And obviously, when people meet me, they meet me while I'm out or on Instagram and things like that. And then they see my videos and it's like, oh, oh, it's this. It's just her fucking talking. So, <laughs> We're gonna do a little bit of unboxing just because I haven't even opened everything. Like, I have so much shit. We will see everything together. Oh, shit. See everything together. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I have felt so crammed back in my parents' house. Like, I feel so weird just filming things and taking pictures. Like, I feel like I can't fucking breathe. And I'm starting to get overwhelmed again, but it's fine. We will use what we have right now. So, I haven't really opened people's gifts. I don't know what is what in what so we'll just open the first one the door is open because it is surprisingly a little chilly in miami again like i told you guys in my last video but this won't last long even though it's supposed to last long even through christmas so hopefully okay so this first thing is ooh, so here, this is so freaking cute. So I got my best friend Brianna a Alex and Ani friends bracelet um, because if you guys didn't know about her, she is a stupid obsessed fan with friends. She knows everything about Friends, about every single episode. She knows the worst every single episode. Like, she is a super fan. So, I decided to get her something, something, you know, something nice. Something that I know she'd wear. Um, she's one of those people that she has everything. And if she wants something, she's going to get it for herself. So, it's really hard to get her a gift. So, when I saw this, I was like, oh my god, I have to get it for her. I'd open it, but it's like already like taped up and stuff. I don't want to really open it, but so you guys get a little... Alex and Ani friends. I love Alex and Ani bracelets. There was a point in my life where I was stupid obsessed with Alex and Ani bracelets. Like you guys have no idea. I loved Alex and Ani bracelets. But I suck at maintaining jewelry. Like I lose everything. So every piece of jewelry I've owned, I've lost. It sucks. But yeah, there was a point where I was stupid obsessed with Alex and Ani bracelets and I would tell everyone to give me Alex and Ani bracelets. So we're gonna put that this in one of these little bags. I think I'm gonna go for this one because it looks cute And we'll do the whole paper thing later. So we got one down. Yay! All right, next one we'll Open it right here. Oh, no, wait, I have this. Oh, this is a bracelet that I got my mom So I got my mom a few things because my mom and I we like share jewelry and things like that And I always get drunk and I lose it. So this one I'm, again, I'm not gonna open it because it's like all taped up and stuff and I, feel, and I don't want to like ruin it I lost this very favorite bracelet of hers. It's like the ones that are like kind of open that they look like that They're beautiful bracelets. I'll leave a picture in here so you guys know which one I'm talking about But um, yeah, I lost it one day when I jumped into a river and I forgot that I had it on and I was drunk And obviously it went bloop, and it came off as soon as I dove in and I feel felt really bad So I got her a new one and I got her some other really nice jewelry pieces as well My mom is another one. She's easy to gift, but it's always like the same gifts so she loves jewelry she loves necklaces and bracelets so i got her a few bracelets and some other things too 
Well, you can't really see it. It looks very small. I don't know how the fuck this is gonna fit my mother. If we have the same size wrist. This looks very small. I'm a little worried. How is this even a thing? How is this a thing? Oh, no, no, no. We're good. We're good. We're good. I think so. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> But it's really cute. It has a little cross and all that stuff. You know moms love anything with crosses in it, so. She told me that she got me three pretty expensive gifts, which is really weird because I didn't ask for anything for Christmas. But she always manages to get me the perfect gift. My mother and I are really good at gift giving because we listen a lot. I don't know if you guys are like that, but I'm a really, really good listener. Anytime I listen to someone say they need something or like want something, and I will literally remember. This is my brother's gift. You guys are going to laugh at this one. So I didn't really know what to get my brother because what I was planning to get him again was the same thing that I got him last year. So he lives in sweats and sweatshirts and hoodies and all that. And he's always stealing everyone. So last year, that's what I got him. So this year, I was like, I need to get him something new so i got him a stash box my brother is the biggest pothead ever ever and his shit is always all over the place and it's like super like it's not even like hygienic anymore so i just got him a new little thing to store his goods which comes with a grinder again i'm not a smoker but i know what's up so i got him a grinder a really nice grinder and it comes with a little thing to a little nice black jar and the box to hide everything so it doesn't smell and the other thing that i got him you know what i've been thinking about lately the poor amazon drivers and workers you guys if you work for amazon thank you i can only imagine how overworked you guys are so thank you you guys save our lives oh this is my brother's other gift let's open it hopefully you can see what it is i got him oh is this it so here is my brother's second part of his gift if you know what it is if you know you know so it's like little hands and it's a ring so it's like for like roaches and little pieces of your blunt so you don't burn your fingers or your nails and it's really hard to get to it so this literally just grabs it and you put it like a little ring and you don't burn your hands so i think he got the best gifts this year and my father's gift i'm also really excited for because i thought it was pretty fucking dope so it's like two little led light things that go on the side of the tv so if you guys didn't know my dad literally lives in the living room that is his room that is his life that is his space he has concerts like every single weekend by himself he blasts music he has this surround system the tv is fucking huge like he is literally there so i just thought to myself well, what can i get my father like what can i possibly do so here you get like a better picture of it can you see it so it's like two light things you can put it behind you can put it on the sides I think on the sides would look really cool in our living room and so basically they're just lights and they connect to the TV they could connect to an Alexa and they go with the music and they go with the movie like the sound so like the light matches like the sound going on and I thought it was super fucking cool and I'm really excited to give it to him because the lights are gonna look so dope in our living room and I'm so excited another part of my mom's gift is this cardigan so it was 30% off in Target which is really weird like Target having 30% off it's from Wild Fable Wild Fable clothes are so great to me Target clothes this brand they last such a long time and it's really good quality some pieces can be either really cheap or really expensive but nonetheless like I don't mind paying for it just because I know it's like really good quality so my mom works from home um, she's been working at home obviously since COVID for a while now she works at the news station and she's had this black cardigan since I can remember like we call it like her famous cardigan she's had it since I was little and she loves it she wears it like almost every day when she works it's like something like she needs to have on but I found one that's just like it just in a different color and I thought she would really appreciate it and it's super cozy and I got it like super oversized and it's so soft and it's amazing and lastly i also got her this like 30 dollar candle which is humongous which is a candle that she's been dying for for so long so this is this brand in target i don't know how to pronounce it so i used to work at a hotel named the one hotel and the one hotel is famous for having a specific scent so the scent is like a cedar wood very oh my god it's just as soon as you walk into that hotel it's like such a comforting smell that they've become famous for their smells they sell a candle just like this of their specific scent like their scent is a specific scent you can't find it anywhere else it is only a one hotel scent and the candle's like over a hundred dollars it's actually a ridiculous amount but i bought a room spray from this brand for this scent because it's the closest thing 
literally identical to the hotel and I gave her the, the room spray but you know it's not the same so I got her the candle the only thing is that the candle is really expensive and I know she wasn't gonna get it and she wasn't gonna go to Target just to buy a candle and I know she forget so I finally got her the candle that she's been talking about forever I think my mom got the best gifts but I think everyone has like their own personalized gifts and I'm really excited to give everyone their gifts so that was my little gift haul really excited to give everyone their gifts tomorrow I'm going to actually go to we're gonna go surprise my uncle he moved like two and a half hours away and he's gonna be away from the family obviously I think this is like the first year so we're gonna go and surprise him and then on Christmas I'm obviously gonna spend with the family I don't know what today has planned let's see what today's affirmation card is I am blessed and I am I am grateful so yeah so lately I've been feeling pretty good pretty good but bad at the same time if that makes any sense I have been feeling a little bit under the weather um, I didn't do anything last week I stayed in just because I was feeling sick I was invited to my cousin's Christmas party and I had to sell out and cancel last minute because I was feeling under the weather and I didn't want to get anybody sick or ruin anyone's mood so I've been kind of anxious when I get sick I get anxious even though I've been enjoying my own company is that weird like I've been feeling anxious but I've been enjoying being alone and like doing nothing and just being home and just watching TV and just like being on my phone but like I don't know I feel like my moods have been shifting back and forth and I kind of feel like I'm going crazy I don't know if you guys ever have those moments of just where like I just don't know like one day I'm in a good mood one day I'm hella depressed one day I have, I'm super hopeful and everything and the next day I'm just like I don't know what to do I'm not motivated to do anything and I'm like am I gonna succeed am I gonna do anything but then I get super excited for the new year because I'm like oh I'm gonna kill it but I'm like I don't wanna I don't know you guys I've been talking for 16 minutes already but you know I'm trying to stay hopeful and I'm trying to enjoy each last day of this stupid year to the fullest and just be grateful for what I have but yeah I'm blessed and I'm grateful for what I have at the end of the day we are just you know we're only here once and we gotta I try really hard not to stress every single day just because every single day here is a blessing so yeah sorry if I'm blabbing a lot I don't really know where this video is going I just decided to turn on my camera today and I was like why don't I just do a little gift haul everything that I purchase I'll put on my Amazon favorites for you guys so yeah you guys should definitely check that out I don't know what I'm gonna do right now I'm probably just gonna pack everything uh, pack everything organize my room since I've been feeling a little crowded and I'm also going to be posting some things on my Poshmark so if you guys are interested in purchasing any of my things I'm going to be posting a shit ton of things on Poshmark just because there's so many things that I haven't worn and I need to get rid of and make some money and just organize myself so that like by the time the holidays are done like I'm ready to go and also answer emails to brands that I haven't responded back to just because my mental hasn't been all there so like I'm kind of like anxious to do more sponsored videos just because my mental health just hasn't been the best these past couple of months and I want to be my fullest like at my fullest like I told you guys I have my energy has been all over the place one day I am okay and some days I'm not and it's okay you know like every day I push through as hard as I can and it is what it is yeah apparently this vlog seems like it's gonna be really long I think my last vlog was really long too but you guys enjoyed it so I think I'm just gonna stick to this okay that's enough talking for right now I think someone is home and I don't know we'll see what the rest of our day brings so on. now it's time to have my first meal of the day it's actually about to be four o'clock so my mom made some ribs so I think I'm gonna make like I think I'm gonna cut off the meat of it and I'm gonna make like a little cool wrap I've been loving like wraps lately they're just so filling and they're so delicious so I think I'm gonna use the meat some peppers lettuce cheese and a little carb tortilla I usually use the three nut carb ones the tomorrow I think is what it's called but they ran out they were there was no more so I got these okay so I think I changed my mind I think I'm gonna make like a little barbecue pizza since they're like barbecue rib pieces so I think I'm gonna use this chipotle sauce as the sauce I guess as the pizza sauce so I'm gonna I already put it in the air fryer a little bit just so it can be really crunchy so good this chipotle sauce you guys 10 out of 10 i think i'm gonna put the meat first down and then the cheese and then i'm going to take a banana pepper i'm gonna take a bite let the juices all out so it's nice and spicy so delicious and then I'm gonna cut pieces and put it on top so 
here it is. So there's our little mini barbecue pizza and I'm gonna put it in the air fryer. Alrighty, so here is my pizza. So again, it's just a low carb tortilla with some of my mom's rib meat that she made today, some uh, peppers, some uh, Mexican three cheese blend, and as the sauce, I just used some chipotle sauce. Super simple and super yummy. I feel like the TV is super fucking loud. I'm so sorry. Okay, so I cut it into a few pieces and I'm actually going to pair it with some ranch. So I usually hate store-bought ranch. Like, I feel like it's disgusting. It's never the same like when you go out to a restaurant. But this one, you guys, is so freaking delicious. I definitely recommend it. I'm super picky when it comes to my in-store ranches because I never get them and I've tried them all and I don't like any of them. But this one, this one is really good as well as their blue cheese. The blue cheese is even better. This lighting doesn't do me any justice, but I'm still cute as fuck. <laughs> what? Lockwell, Miami, baby. I'm making drinks. I'm making Pinterest drinks. Michelle saw this shit on Pinterest. So we're making it. <laughs> taste test. He wanted to take them off. He was like, I have to. You're making a vlog? Yeah. Hello. What's her vlog? Make vlogs to like. Vlog squad Miami. Let me die. Me? I got nothing good to vlog. No. Nope. I think you would have something very funny things to vlog. If it wasn't me, I'd be like, I'm going Hello. You're recording me? Okay, no, ready? bro. You know what we don't One, Please don't. I do like All right. Sammy looks so pretty. <laughs> make a wish, make a wish. <laughs> oh my god. Yay. <laughs> Angelina, Angelina Jolie. Jolie! Brad Pitt! Yes! yes. That was a good one, you see? Uh, Where you go? What we, we, we got out of After high school, what we go to? You go to? Yes! yes. yes. I was like, what we do? Um... When I do, when I take my clothes for you... If I'm on FaceTime I'm, and I'm just... What I'm doing? Uh, yes! No, my what? I'm, I'm doing... Undressing? No, no, no! You're I'm right, not. it's a two words! Strip... Strip tease! Yes! Yes! yes. What he smells all the time! What he smells all the time! Weed? No! 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 no. no. Yes! Yes! yes. Uh, S! Okay, you're right! Next! The first, first, first letter of my name! First and the first letter of my name! No, first, first letter! My name and my first letter of her name! The first letter of her name! And the first letter of her name! S&M! S&M? Yes! S&M? Samantha Michelle! That's like some bondage shit! Okay. Yeah, S&M, I don't know what S&M is. Uh, S&M is, isn't it like S&M? Like Yo, what was the Rihanna. thing called that you, that you guys We're to Rihanna. Yeah. Fuck, I'm really bad at guessing, but okay, I'll try. Come on, come on, come on. We all did pretty good, good though. We all did pretty good. good. Okay. Come on. Okay, um... <laughs> Ooh, um... This guy, hey! That 70 show, five show. No, 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 no. Action Kutcher! Yes! yes. Oh, whatever. Oh, the, the Kylie Jenner's sister! The wife of Kanye! The wife of Kanye! No! The wife of Kanye! The wife of Kanye! Yes! Yeah! You put back. Oh, um, what? Pass, 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 pass. When my tape comes out, it's a... Cleavage! No! Uh, Ooh. nipple slip! My no. mistake! My yes! Mistake. But it's called a... The scientific term. Oh, okay. Next time, next time, next time, next time. Oh, when I dream about you, and so we're gonna dream. dream. Yes! Yeah. Oh, it's when, you uh, when I'm pregnant and he's my baby dad. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. I mean, Bro bros. Oh, no. In a hotel room. Capri Sun. Just chilling. They my kids. Oh. A Scorpio and a Pisces. Hey, I'm into hey, I'm into Scorpios. Two friends chilling in the bathroom. Yo, let me take the bed. They my kids. I'm from town. They my kids. Oh. 
You and me? The two friends are chilling in the bathroom. No, we're not gonna kiss. That's a lie. Don't say that to me. <laughs> That's the start. The start of the night. Yes. You should never call me a fat Kelly Price. You should never call me a fat ass Kelly Price. You get mad off of that little bitty boy, though. I'm blogging for her. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Michelle. My name is Michelle Alvarez. Hey guys, Michelle here. <laughs> Ready? Oh, you ready to do my job for me? me? If I get a bruise, you pay me. Literally, I'm like, where's my camera? It's right there. Michelle, not me. Now play, now play birthday, birthday. It's your birthday. Put that one time. You're the oldest one. I'm the oldest one? Bitch, I'm recording. Vlog Squad Part 2! 